I'm John Lash, class of 2025. I play first base, left-handed pitcher. Um, I go to Charlotte Christian. I play with the South Charlotte Panthers. I'm uncommitted, and this is what's inside my baseball bag. What's up guys, I'm Hype and I had to jump into this video real quick to ask for a huge favor. I need your help of reaching my goal of 25,000 subscribers before the end of 2022. Over 80% of you guys who watch this channel are not subscribed. So do me a favor and hit that subscribe button and if you are subscribed, hit that thumbs up button. It's a huge help on growing the channel. All right, thank you for supporting the channel. Now back to the episode. So for me, um, in terms of my bag, um, this is um, a Louisville Slugger USA Baseball. That's what was given to me um, at the 14U National um, Team Trials. I rock with this. It's a lot of space in here. Um, this is the one I use mostly. Um, change, change for school ball, but for travel ball, I'm gonna rock with this one. Um, and then on it, I always got bag tags, um, lanyard, I mean, just um, things dangling, PG tournaments, um, stuff like that, um, always on it. So in terms of my bag, first thing, uh, my cleats. Um, I have a couple different pairs of cleats. I really like New Balances, really comfy um, for me inside. I feel like I get good movement in them. Um, but so I rock with New Balances for the most part in terms of cleats. Um, <clears throat> as far as my gloves go, um, this is my first baseman's glove right here, Wilson A2000. Um, I've always been a big Wilson guy for first baseman gloves. I don't know, I feel like um, I break them in pretty good and they hold their shape uh, pretty well. So I'll probably still continue to rock with these for Wilson for first baseman's glove. For my pitching gloves, um, this bad boy right here. This is this is my this is my beauty. Um, take care of her. Um, this is the one that was given to me at the Perfect Game Select Festival. I got to customize it. Right here has my name on it. Um, mint green, as you can see. Um, Rawlings. I really do like Rawlings for pitching gloves. This is a Pro Preferred, so the leather is really nice leather. Um, I picked I picked, picked Pro Preferred. Um, it has this wool right here really comfy on my hand. Um, had to go with mint green and pink again. And then right here, um, for God's glory, you know, all baseball players, you know, or all athletes in general have a reason why. So, you know, just making sure you have a reason why what you're doing. Um, so yeah, this is, this is my bad boy. This could be, a, this will be a keeper for a long time. Um, my other pitching glove that I bring with me um, is this Wilson A2000, not fully broken in yet, um, all black, kind of standard for the most part. I'm not too big on Wilson for pitching gloves, I kind of rock more with Rawlings, but um, I like this one, this is Clayton Kershaw's glove, um, all black. I really like, you know, all pitchers close right here um, so they can't, you know, see in it, so I rock with this glove. This is just kind of the casual one, still trying to break it in. Um, for my bats, um, start with the, the, the woody I use for the most time in games. This is my in-game bad boy um, that I take along with me. It's a balm bat. Um, it's custom. I went with blue and hot pink right here. Hot pink, batting grip, blue right here. It's a custom, um, all black. This one's a 33. I swing a 33 for the most part. I'm probably gonna move up to a 34 hopefully next year. But I mean, I love this bomb bat. Um, everyone started using bomb bats a while ago. I kind of hopped on um, the trim with them. You know, it's not, it doesn't break. It's, um, you know, easy to use. I like it a lot. Um, 
I have another wood I use to swing with, um, an loaded one at home, but I mean, that's the one I usually rock with. And then this one, this is a metal one. Um, I usually sw swung at goods, um, and then that one, that one broke. But so this one is the one I got at the P Perfect Game Select Fest. I didn't really like it at first, to be quite honest. Um, but as I broke it in, I really started to like it a lot. Um, it's got sneaky pop. Um, it doesn't sound like it, but it's a really big barrel. Um, Need some new batting grip. This is just straight tape, but I mean, it does the job um, for me for the most part. This is also a 33. Um, this is why I use during high school ball. Um, like these, like these bats a lot. Alright, see you guys. Have a good one. Um, <clears throat> so as we go into my, my bag, my first pocket right here, um, small pocket. Um, I mean, I'm just loaded up with arm sleeves in here, so they're all Evo Shield. Um, you'll always catch me wearing um, Evo Shield. This one's a Perfect Game Select one, and then I think I have a USA one in here, but I mean, um, all the colors you need in here. I got my school ball color too. Um, so I mean, I got always got Evo Shield arm sleeves on deck. And then um, second thing in here, chapstick. I keep this, whether it's Aquaphor or chapstick, um, in my back pocket in the middle of the game, lips ever get dry, um, you know, apply that and I'm, I'm good. So that's the small pocket in the front and then the big pocket. Um, this is where, where everything is right here. Um, easy access for me so um, the arm guard I used to wear um, Evo Shield arm guard a lot you know since, since I'm a righty hitter um, I got to protect my left arm since I'm a lefty pitcher so I always have to have something on my arm I always used to rock with Evo Shield but I mean I feel like I get restricted a little bit um, on my swing and I don't feel like it covers a lot for me so this is what I used to use all black kind of simple um, I keep it in in my bag just in case I lose what I'm about to pull out in a second but um, I, I like it I'm not a huge fan on the Evo Shield um, arm guards but or leg guards but um, that, that, that one's that and then um, this is the one I currently use G form I had another G form too but this is the one that was given to me at the fest as well um, got a lot of stuff there but this is the one I've used in high school season gonna use in travel ball as you can see it's bigger um, you know, I like it a lot, obviously it has the PG logo on it. Pretty worn, but um, I really like this. It's gotten hit a couple times, it saved my arm, so um, really like this. Gonna continue to use G4 for sure, but I always have, a, have another one on deck. <clears throat> for my batting gloves, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a big Franklin guy for my batting gloves. I always have been. Um, I always keep two pairs, no matter what the situation is, in my bag, just in case one rips, breaks, you know, I. I you know, go to second base, slide in it, um, hit a double or something like that, you know, get dirt on it. Um, always have, have two batting gloves, and these break pretty easily, to be quite honest, so I always keep a warranty. I know it sounds stupid or whatever, but I mean, it really, you know, saves you some money for real. Um, so yeah, these are my, my, my Franklin's. I usually go with the casual, just white or black, something like that, just kind of depends. Um, then my helmet, really depends what season I'm in. Um, right now, and travel ball season just started, so um, I, I went with um, you know the East End. This is what most of our team has, East End, and then you know just got the logo on the front. Really comfy, a lot of padding on the inside, fits my head really well. Again, it depends what what season I'm in. School ball, I wear a different helmet, stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I really I really like this helmet. A lot of padding on the inside. Big big guy on comfort, um, playing comfortable. So. Next thing is all my, my kind of pitching stuff, you know, therapy almost stuff. This bad boy right here does the magic for me. Um, it's a massage ball, I'll turn it on, gets the back of my shoulder, whatever I kind of need it to in the moment. Um, before game, pre-game, kind of roll anything, any soreness out that I'm having. Gets me loose after a long day or something like that, deeper into a tournament. So I'll always keep this with me. Let my teammates use it if I need to. Um, along with that, just a lacrosse ball. Um, you know, roll it out, get on the wall, something like that. Um, always need to have a lacrosse ball no matter who you are as a baseball player. Um, I always keep a big band in the bottom of my bag just in case, stretch out legs, something like that. 
Um, I do it for baseball, basketball, whatever it is. Um, so I can stretch on my own. Don't always have to get someone to stretch me. Um, stuff like that. And then the last two things in the bottom of this bad boy are always have to, people use different types of bands, but for me, I use these two. Um, these are ones I get, you know, physical therapy, stuff like that. Do my own exercises before a game to get loose, to get warmed up. Um, so I use these two bad boys to get going with that. And then the last thing I have in here is two packs of Big League Chew. Been eating this since the Little League days. Um, original flavor, of course, um, you have to. Mix it up every once in a while, but I, I'm a pretty pretty simple guy in terms of that. So that's that's about it. So that's what's in my bag.